Hello, this is Frank with Frank's Beautiful Rocks and Minerals. You can see my collection of beautiful rocks and minerals that I have prospected from across the United States and other countries by tipping, typing in on YouTube, Rock and Mineral Identification, followed by my name, Frank Riser, space, capital M period, capital S period. Riser is spelled R-E-I-S-E-R. I encourage you to watch my videos on geology and rock and mineral prospecting and get out there into the field yourself and prospect for those beautiful rocks and minerals. You can support my channel on Patreon. On Patreon, simply type in my name, Frank Riser, M period, S period, and I appreciate your financial support. Your contributions allow me to buy more materials from which to produce more fascinating demonstrations in science. Today I wish to talk about a kilonova that was observed in December of 2021. A kilonova was observed in December of 2021 producing a gamma ray burst that lasted for 50 seconds. Now most supernova produce a gamma ray burst that is observed for only a few seconds. So the kilonova produced a gamma ray burst that was 17 to 50 times larger in magnitude. A kilonova is 1,000 times larger than a supernova. It is incredibly powerful and this is the first time we have observed it. The only thing that could have happened to produce this kilonova was a collision of two neutron stars. A neutron star is a small entity of closely packed neutrons of tremendous energy and gravity. A neutron star has a one teaspoon of which weighs one billion tons. So if you're a billion miles away from the neutron star, you'd be sucked into its gravitational field, crushing you of all life. Supernova occurs during explosions of massive stars that are a runaway fusion that are a mass supernova occurs during explosions of massive stars or runaway fusion reactions of white dwarfs. A white dwarf is a small entity of degenerate matter or plasma produced by the implosion of a red giant star during its death. I encourage you to watch my video on plasma degenerate energy and see what plasma really looks like in the laboratory. In my video, I showed what plasma looks like in the presence of a high voltage field. And you can see that by watching my demonstration by typing in plasma degenerate energy followed by my name, Frank Riser, M period, S period. You know, if you've watched my video on the cross section of a pine needle, or moss, the simple, small, fragile plant, you can see the magnitude of God's creation from single cells in an organism to supermassive stars collapsing and forming supernova or kilonovas of neutron stars colliding together of tremendous energy it's amazing God's universe, incredible his creation. I'm looking forward to going to heaven and seeing God myself to see what kind of entity God is that could have created creation of this kind of magnitude. It is unbelievable to me. And I hope you pick that up in my videos watching me doing science demonstrations. By the way, a supernova with its gamma ray burst let alone a kilonova, produces gamma ray radiation so powerful that if it was to directly hit the earth, even if it was a, b a few billion light years away, it would destroy all life on earth. Very powerful God's creation. From single-celled organisms under the microscope that we've looked at, to supermassive stars and kilonova of producing gamma ray bursts in the universe absolutely beautiful and unbelievable. I live with my mother. We have each other. I never met a wife and moved out of the house. 
I lived with my mother all my life, except when I lived out at Mansfield, Pennsylvania for five years, attending undergraduate school at Mansfield University. My mother died last Saturday, and I'm all alone. But I'm not crying. I'm very happy, because I know that she was an ardent Christian. I'd see her pray alone together. I'd see her pray when she watched Dr. Charles Stanley on the television when he would pray at the end of every one of his sermons. I am looking forward to the day of meeting her again in heaven 35 years from now, a little later or earlier, who knows, I don't know. I just need to quit smoking cigarettes. But in the meantime, I'm down here to produce more videos for you in science. And I appreciate your attention to my videos, and I hope you very much enjoy them. Thank you, and there's more videos to come.